We got our bleach mixture made up. We got our gloves. We got our bleach mixture of 50% bleach, 50% water. Some we're going to spray. And some we're going to just shoot it on with this uh, squeeze bottle. So let's go over to the shirts. Here we have our tub filled with water with our hydrogen peroxide. 9 to 1 ratio to deactivate the bleach. So we're going to be taking the shirts once they're bleached and deactivate them in here. Then put them in the hot wash. And then off to the press. Here we got our bleach and spray bottle. We got our shirts. We're just going to start spraying them. Spraying pretty good. Come over here. Do this green one. And we got some blue ones. Some little kid blues. Hot seller. So what we're going to do is spray these down, wait a few minutes, flip them over, spray them some more, and then put them in our solution, deactivate them. Over here on this table, we're just going to take our squeeze bottles, and I had marked on the shirts where you want to put your bleach. Just gonna start putting our bleach on slow. Take it easy. Do all these, same as we did the other ones. Off to deactivation. Okay, so we got our bleach tie-dye green shirts here for our cannabis shirts. I'll just let them all sit in here for, I don't know, 20 minutes, take a break, you know what I mean? Uh, there's about 20 shirts in here or so. We'll start opening them up and checking them out. So stay tuned. Blue ones. Ready to go. Which one's your favorite? Here you have the regular swirl. Don't worry about it. They all look the same. That's what you want. Because once you put on the transfer, it'll all be different. See that? One was done with two slices of pie filled in with the bleach. And here's with one piece of slice of the pie filled in with the bleach. On the green shirts. Which one do you like?